Hi, my name is Spencer Chan and I'm a student here at SU studying Communication and Rhetorical Studies in the School of Visual and Performing Arts, VPA. A little while ago, we played Duke and broke the all-time student attendant record for college basketball. Gosh, the amount of times I've had to re-record that. It's not every day that you break a record such as that. And I think it's cool. Sure, you could say, hey, we broke this number, we broke this record. But if you weren't there, how could you really understand what it's like to be at an actual game at Syracuse. And so even though I didn't know we were gonna break this record, I vlogged the game. So let's actually talk about the actual game day experience at Syracuse University. And as an undergraduate student, there's only so much you can do to necessarily pre-game. So of course, how do you pre-game as an undergraduate? You go get pizza at Varsity. If you don't know what Varsity is, it's just a pizza joint nearby that a lot of students tend to go to. And so that's what me and my friends did. We went to Varsity and got pizza at Varsity Pizza. I always like going to Marshall Street right before a game because you always see someone like this right before a game. Do they actually get tickets? I don't know, but I will say I really do respect the grind and I hope they do get tickets for the games. And during the weekdays, it's not that busy, but game days, it's packed all the way to the max. You grab a slice of pizza. For you? Can I get a pepperoni slice? Thank you. Ready for the day, man? Pretty hyped. <laughs> Pretty hyped. Are you ready for the game? Yes, sir. Are you watching it? Yes, sir. Thank, Thank you. You have a good one. Out. You sit with your friends and enjoy pizza. And of course, we wanted to talk about our game day predictions and whatnot. So we ended up going to Shine, the student center, and we just talked about our prediction. <laughs> we are now on the top of Shine. What are your thoughts on the upcoming game, guys? Okay, so I have huge faith in us today. We've been playing really good. We're on a three game winning streak. I'm going to say we are going to, it's going to be a close game, but we're going to win 66-62. You know, I'm hyped for Syracuse game. I'm going to say score prediction probably. I'm going to say 75-63 Syracuse. That's a big, that's a big score. I just want to see someone make a half court shot. Yeah. Honestly, I'd be, I'd be pretty hyped with that. Mm, I think it's going to be, hmm. it's going to be, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. it'll be close but exciting. I'm going to go 66-54 Syracuse. It's, it's going to be a close game. It's going to be like 72-64 Syracuse is going to win. Uh, I want to see a half-court shot to end the game. I want to see D over here go on the court, shoot a half-court shot, you know it. <laughs> All right, so me, my friend Jake, and Kaz... On the right of me, your left, um, we grew up in Utica, New York, which is 45 minutes away from Syracuse. So growing up, everyone wears the S on the chest, and we always knew Duke and Syracuse have a big rival since coming to the ACC. These games have been huge. Actually, my first game I've ever watched that was Syracuse was a Duke game at, at a pizzeria. And last year, before we even got accepted, we went to a restaurant in our hometown and watched the game, and we sadly lost last year. But this year is our year. And once we were done recording that little bit, I realized that I needed to have a clear bag for all my camera gear and I didn't have a clear bag and so I had to go back to the dorm and get a clear bag while our two other friends went inside to the Dome Stadium and reserved seats for us. Yo, these seats are insane. Look at this. Ooh. Yo. Oh my god, bro. That's right there. Oh my god. We're heading right, we're over. Coming, coming, we'll see you soon. We're coming, we're coming, we're coming, we're coming. And I will say, if you want to go early and get good seats, you got to show up a few hours early. I will say I had to get a quick little coffee. It is a, going to be a long game. We have an hour out until the game starts. Got a little coffee, gotta get hyped. I'm, I'm hyped. I just gotta drink some coffee though. Fast forward one hour and it's game time. I think the best way to show the environment and what it's actually like to be at a Syracuse game is through a montage. And who doesn't love a montage?
And that's that. Now that the game's over, what did you guys think? What were you surprised by? My favorite part of today was definitely seeing the Syracuse legends like Elijah Hughes, Buddy Beheim, and Cole Swindler. Um, it was very awesome. I was a really big fan of how spirited the crowd is. I really enjoy, you know, how Otto's army gets everyone going. And we even got a sign, which was cool. All right. My favorite part probably was, I didn't even know DeMar Hamlin was going to show up. But, and then I saw him, and I was like, oh my god. I don't know what to say now. I really enjoyed seeing you get the huge face of Michael Jordan. I think that was really funny, and it was, I think it looked pretty cool for him on the floor. Yeah, it was awesome. I liked how crazy and loud the crowd there was. Like, that's the kind of people I fit into. You know what I'm saying? Thank you so much for tuning in to today's video. If you want to see more Syracuse U content, go follow and subscribe to all of our social media platforms. My name is Spencer Chan. You can find me at these ass right here. And until next time, I'll see you later. Bye. Bye.